Okay, first up we are going to do Minotaur. So you will need a one by two plate with a slope on it, plus another one, so you'll need two of those. Now they are, however, two bricks. Then a one by one stud, another slope, and a one by two brick. Take that and just click it on right here. That. There you go. Then you'll need a wheel spinner, Technic pin, another slope, and another stud. I'm going to take this, sorry, this, and I'm going to snap that on there. Then I'm going to take some 1x4 angle plates and put them together right next to each other. I'm going to take this 2x3 plate and put that on top, interlocking it. So then over here, I will take these 1x3 slopes put them right there. Now you need two more of the same kind, the same as the last ones, and I'm going to put them right next to each other. Then I'm going to take this, one by one I think, um, corner plate, and I'm gonna put that there on the um, edge or the corner of it. Then I'm going to take this slope plate, and I'm going to put this right there. I'm going to put this on top here, and this here, and voila, here you go, you have a Lego Minotaur. It's really simple. Drum spinner on this, which, now, of course, as if you stare at this, you can see that this comes, kind of branches off to the side as does this, because this was not ever intended to go between four bricks, or two bricks, or however you want to call it. However, these are the um, scoops that get under the robot. This is the drum spinner. These are kind of the wheels, and it can drive upside down if you want. So you really can just have fun with these. You know, I'm going to be making a bunch more of these, and I really hope you like them. This was a fairly simple build, and I hope it's fairly simple for you, and I hope you have the Legos. Thanks. Thrasher121 signing out.